hi everyone welcome back to my channel and today I want to do a what's in my bag video for you and I have done this um, kind of video previously with my Louis Vuitton Never 4mm and my Balenciaga Velo so today it's all about my Chanel classic double flap in the medium large size with the lambskin finish and the silver hardware so let's get into the bag let's have a look inside here and what i have inside my bag there's not a lot of stuff in there because as you know this bag is quite small and you can't put too much stuff in there which is good for me because i tend to like to keep receipts and napkin from starbucks i don't know why but i always feel like i need to have some kind of napkins and things in my bag um, it's crazy I know but anyways uh, there's nothing like that in here and uh, so my first item is in this front pocket here which would be my iPhone 5 5s and uh, it has my um, Kate Spade case on there so it's quite nice my uh, Louis Vuitton Damir Aben key clay my coach card holder my lipstick which is the lip addict gloss by dior my ysl lip volupte in number three my eos hand cream which is nice and slim and very compact great for this bag my Louis Vuitton six ring key holder, my Louis Vuitton multicolor clay, which I keep my um, cards in there and some cash. And that's it, guys. So let's get into this bag and I will show you what. Uh, uh, the interior looks like and what fits in here so up here if you can see there's oh, a zipper compartment here that you can keep you know your receipt or your um, cash in there if you want to but I tend not to uh, um, go into that pocket very much at all and um, there's a pocket in here as well um, I don't keep anything in there but if I want, I guess I could put my napkins and receipts in there if I wanted to, but I'm not going to mess up this bag. No, nope. it's too expensive to be um, throwing stuff in there. Inside has two main pockets here, two compartments that you can put either lipstick or, you know, all my little um, accessories in there and one big main compartment in there, guys and uh, another front pocket here where I keep my cell phone and uh, a flap here that you can uh, actually close which I tend not to I uh, I just kind of leave this open and, and close the main uh, compartment and it's a turnstile lock very easy to open and uh, so that's that I don't have I yeah I do have a few scratches on there but you know it's a uh, a bag that I can't um, worry too much about it's meant to be used and uh, yes I am careful with it but I'm not going to baby it just you know by not getting it out and use it and um, I love it. Mine is uh, made in France and uh, the date code is in there somewhere. It's just so hard to see with the lighting right now. Um, I did uh, try to do one to show you earlier on with the better lighting but uh, the date code is actually um, on this side. I wonder if I can show you really closely. Uh, 
on the bottom here somewhere. There you go. You can see the sticker on there. Right there. Um, the back pocket have um, quite a roomy spot here to keep your phone in there if you wanted to. Um, however, you might stretch out the leather a little bit. So it's best not to put anything in there. I can probably put my card holder in there fits there quite nicely and snug too and uh, if I do it properly I wouldn't be able to see anything there we go so that's that and I'm going to stand up and show you um, how it looks on me I usually like to carry it with the single chain um, sometimes I do carry it double up double up um, other than that it's single it's good for me too um, what I have on today is just very simple, my dark denim by um, Tommy Hilfiger skinny jeans, my uh, Louis Vuitton belt, my white shirt from uh, The Gap many, many years ago, and I tied the, um, the thingy magic here into a bow, and it does have a little bit of a ruffle um, on one side. Um, my shoes are... Uh, a wedge from um, Primark which is the discounted like clothing store in England and I bought these a few years ago and they are quite comfy actually um, it was very reasonable it wasn't expensive at all so you know really good uh, good price and as you can see my handbag in this single chain and then if I double that up, it looks like so. So that's it guys for my video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any uh, questions or any uh, comment, leave it down below. And uh, please like and subscribe to uh, my channel if you want to. But uh, I'm happy to do this type of video, even though it takes me forever to, to make a video, but I do enjoy uh, making them and I do also enjoy watching a lot of the YouTubers um, making this type of video as well. Thank you so much and once again, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Bye for now.